hey, this is Dan Land Pro. 100 videos in 100 days. Look here, make sure you go over to Wear Master Dan or Dan Land Pro at YouTube.com. Hit that subscribe and the like button. Today we're going over custom thumbnails, YouTube custom thumbnails. As you see, I'm flying my YouTube banner in the back. The reason you want to do custom thumbnails is because whatever your topic is, or your variety of topic, or you might even have a variety of channels, you want your viewers or your subscribers to be able to pick a specific topic that they may be interested in. For example, I do a variety of different topics like home improvement, I might do social dance, I might do religion, I might do uh, motivational speaking, educational, etc., etc. So when people come there, I usually have my titles to kind of complement whatever the subject is. So they call them custom thumbnails. And the reason I do that is because have you ever been to a channel where you just seen maybe 50 videos, but all of them have the exact same thumbnail? So you really don't know what to choose on that channel because it's not really specifying what that particular video is about. So it may have episode one, episode two, all the way up to 50, episode 50. And you won't know which episode applies to what because there's no custom thumbnail to determine or specify what that video is about. So the reason for that, or as recommended or suggested, is that you create custom thumbnails to direct or guide your visitors and subscribers to certain topics. So I'm gonna give you an example of what I mean by that. So as you notice, these are custom thumbnails and you see as they rotate through, you got different subjects for different uh, thumbnails or different videos. For example, Webmaster Dan at YouTube.com. When you go to my channel at Webmaster Dan or Dan Land Pro, you're gonna see custom thumbnails to suggest what a specific video might be about. And that way, whatever your interest is on that channel, whether you're new or revisiting, you have some idea of what that video is about. We're gonna do a tutorial on how to do custom thumbnails, which we usually do in programs like Adobe Rush, uh, Adobe Premiere, uh, you can also do them in Canva over on Windows or place it over for Mac. You got a variety of programs that offer you platforms and even templates to do your custom thumbnails in YouTube.com. So you don't have to take our recommendations, but we do recommend and suggest that you try to uh, use custom thumbnails in order to direct and guide your visitors. Like I said, we're flying our YouTube banner today. We just want to go over the custom thumbnails and I'm going to show you how to use text. You can use motion graphic text. You can use uh, static text. And you can also do some text in uh, Premiere. For example, in Premiere, you can do uh, uh, graphic text, essential graphics, or you can do uh, custom statics, or you can use the legacy where they have some templates already laid out where you can use certain text. Each program offer different templates, different styles and ways to create custom thumbnails. So again, our suggestion is that you use custom thumbnails in order to direct people on your channels to different uh, uh, forms of video. You can also use custom thumbnails on other platforms like uh, social media, like Facebook and others, in order to do the same thing, to give your visitors some idea of what your video or your content creation may be about. Hey, my name is Dan Land Pro. Stay tuned for when we bring you a tutorial on how to make custom thumbnails coming real soon. Hey, until next time, YouTube.com, 100 videos in 100 days. Webmaster Dan or Dan Land Pro. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button for me. Hey, peace.